Hello, hello. Welcome back again, everybody. Uh, look, I just got to back up. I wanted to grab something here. Uh, this is an update video on erythromycin, if that's how you even pronounce it. Um, I'd done a video indicating that I had uh, red slime algae. I showed you guys. It uh, was everywhere. I did not clean any of it out. I did uh, kind of stirred some of it up. It was on the rocks. And it actually, within a day, I was down to very few little hairs of the bacteria, um, the red slime down like down on the substrate and stuff, just a little here and there. And then by the next day, it was completely gone. Now, so that worked great. There is one problem. I don't know if this is anything to do with the uh, with the medication or not, but my uh, big coral there in the middle is appears to be dying um, I'm really not sure it's not turning brown or anything so I've left it in um, it, like this could just be some normal cycle or whatever but the skeleton is showing so I'm assuming it's gonna die um, yeah I really don't know it's kind of upsetting to lose that because it was a bit of a focal point in the tank obviously when I back up and you look um, I'm gonna leave it a little longer I know you're not supposed to anytime a coral dies you're supposed to remove it right away but um, I'm just holding on to hope there uh, it, it, I've got no idea what did it it just so happens it was you know it's about two days after I put this stuff in I put ten little packages in which is what uh, it had said so yeah yeah, it's kind of shitty. I was wondering um, if this is what did it. So this is the product here, just so you guys can see it. Um, you know, if you have the red slime, though, that is what the uh, fish store recommended, rather than uh, slime away. And uh, like, I don't even have anything left. I don't have a single hair of it. I've been looking. I can't find anything in here. So. Great confidence that uh, that stuff will cure. This is a 90 gallon and another uh, 10 in the sump or whatever is in the sump. Um, so, and I put 10 packs in. And uh, that's it. I just wanted to do the update that if you do have red slime, uh, get this shit. It's uh, whatever. I took care of it. The only thing you might want to be aware of is, like I said, with that coral. Not really sure what's uh, happening there. This one seems fine. Um, no problem. I don't even know what that is, really. Um, it's uh, kind of weird. I don't know. These were just like ones that I got on sale, so I don't even know what they are. But it didn't seem to affect the, uh, the zoos at all or the mushroom. They're doing fine, so... Um, yeah, it could just be a coincidence. Maybe that thing was just ready to die, or I don't know. The little crab's been picking at it. I've seen them doing it. it like it was growing vines and shit everywhere, but they uh, they may have done something to it that it didn't like. But um, that's it, guys. I just wanted to kind of give you an update. Look at he's gonna start organizing rocks. He uh, he does this. I don't know why. He just starts like eating them and organizing them he's just being cool I could make you guys like an hour long video just to this guy picking up rocks I think he's picking in the, for food or something but sometimes he just carries rocks around and so does that guy Big Blue Tang will actually play with uh, like you know empty shells or things like that he'll carry them around the tank um, it's kinda weird I wish I'd gotten a video of it for you guys but I don't have anything um, the other thing I want to point out about erythromycin, sorry if the pronunciation's wrong there, is that um, my water, like two days later, was crystal clear. Keep in mind, I haven't even wiped my glass, but look how clear that is. It came out very clear. Um, I'm guessing that's to do with that shit, because I haven't done anything. Uh, so that's it. Hope you guys enjoy. If you had red slime, you know. At least you can see a comparison from before and after, what it looks like. Alright, have a good one.